Hey guys, what's up? Sermon 11 here. Um, yeah, you haven't seen any videos in a while. I've been busy, so that's about it. I've been busy with school. I, I said I could do like those videos um every day. I think I like tweeted that and put it on Facebook, but um, some things came up. I had different school work to work on, and then if I start early, I would still somehow end up finishing my school work late. So yeah, I don't need to hold a mic anyway. So I'm gonna I'm gonna hold this down. You should still be able to uh, hear me. If you can't hear me, just turn it up. Okay, let's go. I originally did a video like this. I reviewed that footage in it. Um, I made this video based on that. Victorious and iCarly are good shows on Nick, but today I will review. <laughs> oh man, I will reveal my thoughts on the series and what has happened to them iCarly started off pretty good and it was a show I would gladly tune into every su um, Saturday, but now it just seems boring and needs to die. Drake and Josh and Zoe 101, two shows by the creator of iCarly and Victoria's had better concepts. Basically what I'm saying is that Drake and Josh and Zoe had more freedom and places to go. Drake and Josh could go anywhere. The concept is just about stepbrothers. Zoe 101 was a freaking school. They could just add new areas, explore rumors and other things. iCarly's concept was about making a web show. It's not even present in every episode. If it is, it's just a small clip so you know they still make those things. The show focuses less and less on it and more on the characters' lives. That's cool, but I don't um that's cool, but don't make the concept so limited. It just doesn't seem right. The writers even left a plot hole. Mr. Howard has a wife, but in another episode it is said that he and Miss Briggs were making out. Gibby being in every episode, he doesn't really fit with the main characters. The characters are already stupid on different levels, and now we have another stupid one. He doesn't even take his shirt off anymore. The character pretty much lost who he was and became someone else. I find that, um, I find that, oh wow, I got lost. I find that fact that, okay, I find that fact that little girls and boys ship the characters together pretty disgusting. There's a ton of videos like that with the characters and um, scenes of them that could possibly hint to a love interest with each other and music in the background. It's so dumb. You can like a show, but you're going too far. I feel it's even weird that some of the parents approve of behavior like this. This, this is kind of a joke and kind of not. But Freddy needs some bigger shirts. Shirts and um, shirts shouldn't be that tight on you. And um, it's like he matured and grew up, but he didn't wear bigger clothing and just kept his old stuff. Spencer has said things in the episodes that and not explained them, which um, makes me think the writers were hinting at something mature but couldn't say it on TV. I don't really like the fact that Chuck had to leave the show and be on Disney X Disney XD's um Pair of Kings. His real name is Ryan, if you didn't know. Um, replacing him with someone else kind of makes the show worse. Yeah, no. Replacing him with someone else even makes it worse. Plus, they mentioned him in an episode, but they have no way of showing him. I call it used to um, air videos that people send in to them in every episode. Not every episode, but at the end of that episode. This is like the first season, at least. Um, what happened to that? The seasons feel as um, they're getting shorter and shorter. The show is going to end soon. People knew that before it was announced. The whole concept of high school and their show is so wrong. Kids don't actually act like this. For example, the whole thing with Sam and Freddie kissing. Carly was so stuck on this. She said something on the lines, you guys are my best friends. Why didn't you tell me? Why would it matter? They're friends for Pete's sake. You don't tell each other everything you do. And um, let me see, uh, for example, would you call your friend and tell them that you're using the bathroom? The whole concept, the whole thing about Gibby getting angry because he supposedly saw Freddie and his girlfriend kissing or something, he wouldn't even listen and they were going to air the fight online on iCarly. Some, <laughs> Some stuff like this would never happen in real life. Possibly the, um, the not listening part, but the violence online is usually taken down. There was an episode where the whole apartment didn't have power because it was too hot. Somehow everyone ends up in their apartment. Who would really allow this? I know most of them forced their way in, but I wouldn't even have opened my door. Also, what's with their door always being open? Seriously, anyone could walk in. Around season 4, the series became really short episode-wise. This continues to the end of the series. Maybe I'm going way too deep in this. I call it ends in November. Enjoy what's left. Um, originally
Unfortunately, I was going to end the video right here, but uh, let me see. There was, uh, there was more things I wanted to talk about. The whole Carly um, getting so weirded out. Like, well, not weirded out. She was, like, so into Sam and Freddy kissing. It was so weird. It was like she liked one of them, like Freddy or something. Um, there was part of that episode they didn't air. Um, something else. The whole school making fun of, fun of Freddy because he said he didn't kiss a girl. How is that... Like, you shouldn't pick on someone in the first place, but how is that even something to pick on someone for? It's so stupid. I'm sure a ton of kids haven't had their first kiss in high school, or you shouldn't have it in middle school or elementary school. You shouldn't even have... Yeah, you shouldn't have it in high school either. I think you should have it, like, um, maybe when you're on a date and you're out of school or something. It's just my opinion. And, like, all those boys showing up to, uh, sp speed date with Carly. And, um, the whole thing with Carly leaving that boy because, um, what was his name? Like, Griffin? Because he had, like, peewee babies. Like, are people really that shallow? If you do something... If you do something that's different from someone else, you, um, you're automatically, uh, like, they don't want to be your friend, what am I trying to say? Um, you, you know what I mean, I'm, I'm sorry, I, I'm not used to, like, just talking without anything written down, but, um, yeah, that's about it, thanks for watching, peace. Uh, you know all the stuff. Comment, rate, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, uh, like me on Facebook. All that stuff will be in the description. Peace.